Now that we know how the prefab works, let's create an in-game item and connect it to an NFT. So let's create a new object. Let's make it a sphere. Uh, let's adjust the size. Great. Now let's go back to the script, add a public variable, uh, game object. Let's call it um, sphere. And in here, instead of saying balance of, we'll have some logic that says if the balance of is greater than zero, meaning they have the item, then change the color, uh, sphere get component render dot material dot color, oh, sorry, dot set color. and we'll make the color uh, red, okay? So to summarize, we will say, fetch the balance of the user's token. If the balance is greater than zero or one, then change the sphere from white to red. All right, let's hook this up. Under scripts, I'm going to drag in the sphere and I'm going to give it a play. Great, it works. So next step is to mint this NFT on an open marketplace and I'll see you in a bit.